What's up everybody, BamaShox here, doing an intro to another video. Like I said, we did split the last one up, because it was just way too much to consume in one video, so we're going to put that here. This is our conversation about the different tungsten worm weights we purchased. One set was from Academy, one set was from Dix, and one set was from a local company here around Locust Fork, Alabama, called Tun Titan. Titan Tungsten. Get into that and tell you why. That will be our go-to tungsten. Boom. Oof. So I did a thing. We will have to get some some fishing video to go with all this. I just ordered some tungsten the other day. Ordered all of these within eight hours of each other we'll finish with this five pack i got here we'll finish with those guys so ordered two from academy two from academy two from dicks okay then i ordered five right here and we'll talk about them in a minute real excited about that so vmc eagle claw four in each pack h205 in the pack Strike King four in a pack. These are all eighth ounce worm weights. Cover up the old address. That's Titan. That's Dix. Which was these two. All right. So should have put the price in the back of here. Do a comparison that way. <clears throat> yeah, address is not on here, so we can use that. All right. H2 Express, five in a pack, $5.99. Strike King, four in a pack, $5.99. VMC, four in a pack. And VMC was $6.99. Eagle Claw, would have thought they would have been the cheapest, were actually the most expensive at $8.49 for four. Come over here to Titan Tungsten, whopping $5.99 a pack for four. I say whopping because, I, you know, everybody's like, oh my God, $8.49 is so high, but well, we drop right back down here. So, now the reason I did step out and all of these are worm or green, green pumpkin worm colors. So we'll bring these down here. These here. I have a strange feeling if I open them up, I won't be able to tell the difference in any of them. Yeah, I will. Titan looks better. Now these are just the, the VMCs look like they're just straight green. The Eagle Claw do have black specks in them. The H2O is straight green. These actually look more brown than green. These ha the Titans do have the black dots in it. And it looks like it's just the same glitter you would put in uh, soft plastics. So everything's eighth ounce worm weight in green pumpkin. But these three are all $5.99. Of the three, better value would be H2O. But if you look at the plastic, that H2O has been sitting on that shelf for a long time. So that doesn't strike, doesn't speak good to me. VMCs are poorly packaged because they're all over the place. Again, these were $6.99. Then the Eagle Claw, which physically looks smaller than the rest of them, a whopping $8.49 for four. So I can definitely tell you, never buy those again. Never buy those again. If I'm in the store and I have to have weight that day, either one of these will be good at the same price. But I can tell you this, moving forward, seeing how the market is, they're all relatively the same price. We are 1000% going to be sticking with Titan Tungsten. I need to go back and order some quarter ounce for our moving waters. These are gonna be good for our ponds 
but for our rivers and lakes on the kayak we're really going to need some quarter ounce or at least a 3 16 i don't know titan tungsten we are part of their pro staff for 2021 i just realized i'm recording my recording over here we're part of their pro staff for 2021 means we get a special discount just for buying their stuff and talking about it gladly gonna talk about it so 5.99 retail i actually got it for a little bit cheaper than that so why would i not buy these unless i'm in a pinch and i have to go with what's in the store don't let me find a bait shop that's carrying these matter of fact i may check my local bait shop and see if i can get them in touch with each other because titan tungsten's really local like i can get there in 45 minutes it's in locust fork alabama really nice people over there now i will tell you small business big company these were able to ship and get to me quicker but small business you know they take that you know they try to you know let their employees off for the weekend kind of stuff so they were shipped on monday and i had them tuesday these guys shipped over the weekend you know difference in a big company small business but i can tell you just looking at all of them we're gonna be very happy with titan tungsten very happy about to open them up and look at them in our terminal box Which one's the terminal box? The heavy one. Always the heavy one. Okay. Got us a bunch of junk in here. There's a rooster tail. I think that's supposed to be in the jig box. Actually, we'll throw all this in the crap crappie box. Yeah, there's a lot of lead up in here. I probably need to pick up some hooks next time I go out. So, all right, back with a knife. Where's the H2O? My utility knife for work. Didn't bother looking for the other one. Mainly because I don't remember where I put that tackle bag when I swapped over to the loose. I must say, currently own three lose products two more on the way and i don't have a single complaint with them love the bag love the ride and reel i mean it was a even though it was an xfinity you know walmart exclusive still a quality setup 120 bucks and okay yeah these are pretty smooth drop the solid green ones there see what these are vmc's but bama you're mixing them up yeah i really don't care yeah these are straight green let's let's compare the two like variants in the colors these are brighter kind of glossier these are just kind of duller i think i prefer the dull to the glossy but Whichever one triggers fish. This is kind of the comparison I'm curious about. It's the Eagle Claw versus the Titan. Titan, $2.50 cheaper per pack. Yeah, the Eagle Claw ones just... They look like they got a plastic guide in them. That's interesting. I didn't notice that about any of those or any I've bought so far. So... Okay, those there. We got the Strike King. Yeah, I'm a little, a little peeved at the H2O being packaged so tightly. And all these just open right up. Yeah, these are the dull gray or dull green. Like the first ones. These kind of have a, a hexagonal. Nope, not a hexagon. That's six sides. Yeah, hexagonal. Six sides. Correct me in the comments. That's fine. Then we got all this juicy Titan. Matter of fact, get 100 likes on this video and I'll just give those two to somebody down the road to further the product. 
y'all let me know in the comments if yeah see these are so great they uh, of all of them only ones i noticed that have the weight road on them these are far superior in my eye because i can just look take a glance at them and i know what i'm picking up i can dump all the titan in one box and at a glance i can grab the right ones so yeah love to give those away give me get, get us to 100 likes and we'll do a nice little giveaway i love giving stuff away thinking about a new one next week y'all better be ready for that one better go ahead and like and subscribe now because if you miss that giveaway next week you are going to be kicking yourself everybody likes free reels right Ah, it's just trash. Let's see if we can get see if we can get two two of these gamer goos in here. I think I'm I think I'm now getting a little ambitious. That's enough gamer goo to last me all summer. I right, took the sticker off and I've got a copy of those orders in there. I ordered more gamer goo last week. That's when I ordered the Beach Breeze. Give us some more throw all our trash. That's one thing I like about this. The only thing, one of the only things I don't like about tungsten in general is all the packaging. Now you tell me how you feel about tungsten versus lead. I obviously still have lead. I paid for it. I'm going to use it. You know, there's a lot of studies out there about lead affecting. Uh, wildlife fish life depends on who you ask and which study you read into yeah we'll take these titans put them right here for the giveaway don't want to lose them there's no way because that was let's do the math 12 24 Plus five, 29. There's 29 eight ounce worm weights in there. There's no way I'll go through that in a week's time. All right, I'll clean up this mess here and I'm gonna do with the camcorder. Anybody know? Well, that was our conversation about tungsten worm weights and how we're gonna be using, uh, you know, mostly Titan tungsten moving forward, local company here. Not too far away, uh, over in Locust Fork, Alabama. Seem to be a really reputable company so far. Great communication with them and superior product, if you ask me. When everything is hitting the market at five ninety nine or higher, and you get a quality product at five ninety nine, they're locally based. Support small businesses. Stick with them. Uh, we do appreciate them inviting us to be on their pro staff for twenty twenty one. Here's to a long relationship moving forward, guys. Also, we are a member of the geek to geek Media Network. We are a network of like-minded, geeky people, a bunch of podcasters, streamers, YouTuber, as well as bloggers and other things. You check all that out over at geek to geekmediacom That's going to be it for me today. We'll see you guys on Sunday where we're going to hit the water. So until then, let's go fishing.